Hi everyone, it's Miss Dragonfly back again, here to bring you another segment on love, relationships and life. So, how young is too young to get married and what's the best age to be at to get married? Well, when we get married, we want the marriage to work. We want it to be a marriage that lasts, it to be our only marriage, don't we? So for that, we need to find the right partner. And to match up with the right partner, you need three things. Firstly, you need to be able to get along naturally just by being yourself. Secondly, you need to have the same values. And thirdly, you need to have the same goals. And you need to match on all three of those things in order to, for the marriage to last, or indeed any relationship to last. Now, the thing is, our adult personality actually doesn't stabilize until we're in our mid-twenties at least. That's generally. And it's not until a few years later when we're about 30 that we truly know what it is that we want in life, what we want to achieve, and where we want to go in life. Though, you must match all of them with a partner. Therefore, the best age to get married generally would be late 20s to early 30s. And so, your personality, adult personality gets to stabilise and so then you're able to fulfill the first factor in getting along naturally as you are. Secondly, you know, your, your, values, your values and your goals, that's what you also know, and then you can match up with your partner. Otherwise, if you marry before that happens, then the relationship can still break up as you grow older and um, your, your, your values and your goals change because they don't really set until your late 20s to early 30s. So we want to marry once in our life and we want it to last. So for, for the marriage age, generally the best time is late 20s and early 30s. Thanks for watching the video. And if you've enjoyed it, then please give it a thumbs up, share and subscribe. Now, we keep hearing from singles all the time about why they stay single and their argument for staying single and why it's best to stay single is that you have more freedom. Now, is that true? Oh, well, on the face of it, I guess if you think um, simply it may be true, but is it really true? So, it may not be true. So, I will give you giving my view on that next week and we'll go through it next week. So, join me for that. And in the meantime, if you would like to have a chat with me, have a consulting session or have a life reading because I am also a metaphysicist, then just click on the booking link and it will take you to my website where you can make your booking. And a reminder that I upload my videos every Wednesdays in the Asia Pacific and Tuesdays everywhere else. So I'll see you then. Bye for now.